Hello everyone, this is my quick update to the last episode where I explained to you how to save presets in the new attack screen. Uh, so we managed to find the general cause um, which was making it impossible to save the preset, even if we select a single wave. But the trick is that some of you just unclick all the waves, just like I'm doing now, and only leave one wave. So you may think that yeah, you only have one wave checked, right? Actually, no, because some of those uh, rows are invisible um, until you unlock them. So for example, um, you can have a row with support tools um, for each attack, but in my case, I haven't unlocked support tools yet, so I'm not seeing this, um, this row, but this row is invisible in the list and it is actually marked because all um, all the rows were marked and we unticked all of them, but we didn't see the support tools uh, wave, which was ticked by default. So we unticked all we saw, but we didn't untick the ones we didn't see. Um, so in this case, we have this one only, but in reality, also other waves are selected, which we can't see. So to fix this, uh, you need to unclick all waves icon. If you see a green uh, color in this box, then it's a it, it's a problem because it's not gonna work as you can see. Uh, yeah, I only have first wave selected, and presets cannot be applied to support tools. So I guess it's gonna be fixed soon. But for the moment, for you to be able to use presets normally, um, you need to yeah, as you can see, you can't save it. So you need to unclick on this button, and then only click the first wave. Or if you have all waves clicked, then unclick to have no waves selected and only select the one wave you want um, to use. And in this situation, you can save the selection to, to your preset. So that's the fix. Again, if you have any questions, uh, leave them in comment, leave a like and see you next one. Bye.